Christmas. Well, they're kind of empty, but we love these. It's like these pumpkin cookies and the macros are here. So good. I can tell you my problems, meditating my silence. But I keep pushing my pen, rotating my stylus. Brokenness feeling like seeing, not no breath, low dollar. Used to be left on red, now all the girls go holler. Now all the girls go follow. All the fake friends gon' pile up. I need peace to borrow, get that shit right back tomorrow. Somehow all the fans gon' rival. Smile so much to hide my sorrow. Faith the shaky in I can't hold a frown too long. I can't stay down too long. Love me, brother. 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 Love Couple things I show, couple things I don't I can tell you my problems, I can tell you my sins I can tell you my problems, I'm uncomfortable in my skin I'm uncomfortable with my ends, I'm uncomfortable with my friends I'm uncomfortable with my drinking, I'm uncomfortable with my thinking I'm uncomfortable with my ways, I'm uncomfortable in this space I'm uncomfortable on good days, I'm uncomfortable on bad days I'm uncomfortable with my soul, I'm uncomfortable with my heart I'm uncomfortable with myself, I'm uncomfortable with my heart I'm uncomfortable with my thoughts, I'm uncomfortable with my feelings And sadly, I'm uncomfortable with healing sweat I've been sweating less and less um, with the walking on the incline but I'm still keeping it up I feel like jump roping if you've been watching on Instagram I've been trying to get this jump rope routine down I'm having so much fun trying to learn new little routines with the jump rope so I'm gonna do that today and I want to lift but I actually feel like doing walking lunges and hip thrust like some glute work which let me talk about my one second yeah i don't think they know that's my way i don't think they know that's my way yeah that's my hold up you gonna say what they say play so i skip straight ahead to the bread part top out i'm cool on the chit chat i ain't a kid no i got the gift today I am pleasantly surprised with like I actually decided to track the jumps this time so the new one. but I've been taking a mad break and I forgot to stop the clock I've been sitting here texting <laughs> but I'm gonna get back to jumping rope Done with the cardio for now. I got it, but I need to see if it I did it quick enough to match the music I want to post it to. Yo, average, pop a twist cabbage off instinct. Niggas don't think stink pink gators. My Detroit players, Tim's for my hula games in Brooklyn. That's right. Dead right, if the head right, biggie there, air night. Pop them in smooth since days are under rules. Never lose, never choose to. But oh, I'm feeling so good about that. I need to find another jump rope kind of routine thing. Some really good cardio today. Looking pretty good. I need to move into my lifts. I've been getting so caught up doing the jump rope that my cardio is going crazy right now. I don't know if y'all can even hear me. I should have brought a mic. Dang it. You know, I'm just going to put a voiceover over my workout because I did want to chat with you about my workout, my programming and that kind of stuff. Hey, 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 what's up, you guys? Thanks for tuning in. If you're enjoying it, don't forget to give this video a like. Make sure you're subscribed. 
And okay, so I kind of want to talk about the gym. You might notice, I mean, I'm doing a lot in the gym in general. It's just a lot of different things that I'm doing. <laughs> I'm not currently following a program. There are some things that I make sure I do, which is just like the three big lifts. And I make sure I hit my cardio in, right? And I'm just doing things that really bring me joy. And I'm having a lot of fun doing this in the gym. And today I felt like doing some glute work. So we did hip thrusts. I did four sets of 12 to 15 reps. I worked up in weight. I like to keep my hip thrusts really, really light and just try to do higher reps. Then I moved into these goblet squats, which for me, I'm definitely focusing on my glutes when I do them. And this is me just doing more what I would call fun work. Because I have a bunch of things I'm trying to do in the gym. I want to learn how to do handstands. I want to eventually be able to do a pull-up. And with the gymnastics classes that I'm taking, I'm taking a calisthenics class that has me wanting to focus on on acquiring a couple basic skills. I want to work on my pistol squats, doing an L sit, hitting toes to bar. It's a bunch of different little goals that I have in mind. And so I just have fun in the gym doing small exercises that'll help me to hit those goals. I'm trying to like slowly lower myself, like basically do reverse pull-ups, like just focusing on the negative. Too hard. I gotta do it at the so like I said, right now I'm just doing things I'm having fun with in the gym and because I have small goals like being able to pistol squat, doing toes to bar and all these other things I want to learn to be able to advance in calisthenics in the future, I'm just working on small movements now and flexibility and mobility that'll help me to get better for those exercises that I want to be able to do. So right now what you're watching is me do a lying leg lift and eventually I get into, I think they're called pike leg raises, I can't remember. But these exercises would help with you being able to eventually hit a toes to bar. So that's why I'm doing such different type of exercises. I have a bunch of little goals and things that I want to do in the gym. Like it's just fun to challenge yourself to learn new movements and try new things. And I'm really excited about the calisthenics journey, the handstand journey, and just getting more into this type of training. Um, I mean, I'm still going to be lifting weights. I love weight lifting and I love lifting heavy, but yeah, it's just fun finding different things that you enjoy to do and that keep you inspired and wanting to go to the gym. back home clearly and aren't they so pretty oh, i wish i would have hung them up sooner but i kind of forgot i had them <laughs> so i didn't pack my mic at the gym that's my bad i did a little bit of voiceover talking about some of the you know new kind of exercises i'm throwing in here and there but what i really kind of wanted to talk about was my programming which there is none <laughs> and you might have noticed that i mean I always, always, always make sure that I do my compound lifts, squat, bench, and deadlift. Other than that, I'm kind of just winging it. I'm making sure I do my cardio and I'm making sure I do my compound lifts. And anything else I do is just for fun, just for extra, whatever I feel like working that day. And yeah, I'm really enjoying it like that. I do know, especially with the new year coming, I plan to be going back to the powerlifting gym. Eventually that coach is gonna give me a program so things will tailor because I have to prepare for my meet. But right now I'm just having fun trying to progressively overload, do the three main lifts, set my own goals and having fun with everything else. I plan to keep up the gymnastics and I'll probably just go to class once, maybe twice a week because they also have the calisthenics class and it's hard trying to like, this week I'll do tumbling and this week I'll do calisthenics and you know? So I'm definitely gonna commit to going to that gym once a week because I'm trying to take 
multiple classes that they offer. But yeah, I'm just really enjoying loving my workouts, loving moving my body and seeing what it can do. And testing myself, that's what's so cool. It's so many different types of fitness. You know, whether you're into calisthenics or body weight training or cardio or running or jumping rope or doing gym, like there's just so many ways for you to move your body and to stay active. I'm super excited about the calisthenics cut stuff. I feel like to really excel in that, well, you need to weigh a little less <laughs> because it's all about control over your body and working all of these muscles. And the heavier you are, the harder you'll find some things to be. I'm still enjoying taking the classes that I have taken and just trying to work on some of the core movements that I think I need to get down in order to like eventually step up my game with the calisthenics. So that's why I was doing the hip work today. It's also why you might have seen me practicing, not today, but in an earlier vlog, my pistol squats. I wanna, you know, I wanna hit a pull up eventually. Like there's so much, but I, I know my body weight makes it a little difficult to do some of those things. And so I'm excited to see improvements with calisthenics specifically as I lose more fat. But yeah, right now I'm just having fun doing a little bit of everything. I'm not following a strict program. I'm just making sure I do cardio at least 30 minutes a day and squat bench and deadlift. <laughs> and um, because I am passionate about other things, I just do other things. My eyes are heavy. I'm sleepy. Can you tell? Oh, I need to go to bed. So I'm in the middle of like reorganizing my life, really my bedroom, my gym clothes. You ever have a day where like, well maybe a month where you don't put things back where they're supposed to be and then it kind of results in like everything just being disorganized and a hot mess. And I'm finding leggings in my sock drawer, I'm finding bras and it's just everything's, a hot mess and I'm in the middle of doing a lot of laundry so like you know what let me just reorganize everything wash a ton of my clothes but also just like choosing specific drawers for um specific you know clothing items and anyway this is just a long way for me to preface that this is what I'm looking at today is this <laughs> because I decided and yes it's really late I decided to, yeah, just go through all my stuff. Just kind of kind of clean and organize things. And I think I'm actually going to fold up my gym clothes. And I have so much gym stuff. Just because, I mean, I've been, I guess, the majority of my wardrobe because this is my life, you know? But yeah, so I started folding some things. And I thought, you know what? I could just make, I could time lapse it. Like, that's what I'm going to do. And I actually looked up how to fold it, fold your gym clothes, like the Marie Kondo way. We're going to see how long this lasts. I'm hoping I keep it up because yeah, usually I'm really, really bad with my gym clothes. I just be chucking them in drawers and stuff. And I have so many, this is just leggings. I have so many. I want to be able to, you know, use them all, wear different colors, mix match, like plan out my gym outfits a bit better sometimes. So... That's what we about to do. And I'll put on some TV, it's late. I'ma just zone out and clean. And sometimes that's really nice. It's really therapeutic doing that kind of stuff sometimes, right? Like cleaning can be so therapeutic. If it's all a simulation, I'ma set it then there's no need to fuss about it. Lost my drive, I don't even feel alive. Was a program to live without it? It's time to level up, do things I've never done. No need for player two. Still working on player one. Heart ain't broken, but it's bent. Try to open up again. This didn't take very long. Um, and it's crazy how, I guess, wow, it really does maximize space. But yeah, I'm gonna put this away and then just get to like putting all the clothes away and cleaning, cleaning my living space because this be a mess. guys I'm a little shocked don't mind the little tabs because I'm trying to change up the drawers I'm gonna write notes for like what goes where so I can remember because <laughs> I'm creating a new system but I am shocked because like I can't believe how many leggings are fitting in this like this is crazy like are you kidding this is insane <laughs> I'm still going through all my clothes, so I'm sure I'll come across 
maybe a few more leggings here and there, but all of that fits in those two drawers. I, like how? Like I know people say folding clothes save space, but I guess I never really believed it. <laughs> this is absolutely insane to me because I used to have those leggings take up several drawers because I would just throw them in there. Now I get it, now I get it. I also, while packing some away, I came across some that I was like, yo, I don't think I've worn these yet. Or yo, I've only worn these once or twice. I've been looking for this. Yeah, I need to start. I'm gonna try to keep this up. I get why I get why the girlies do it now. I get it because I mean, look at that. She's a beauty, okay? She is a beauty. If it's all a simulation, I'm set. Then there's no need to fuss about it. Lost my drive, I don't even feel alive. Was I programmed to live without it? It's time to 